lovely ladies and what's another name for dudes? What's a compliment? No, I'm not. She wears a rubber coat for the coming of the new Hello, lovely ladies and big papas. So I have spoken of Munchie in my videos. Well, here he is, lounging on my bed as if he owns it. This is what I do. From the future. From the future. This is going to be a long video. It's going to be a really long video. We're, we're, we, at the moment, we don't know if it's broken up or if it's just one really long video. How many links we post? As of now, we have zero. But through the course of the video, there will be a lot of links. So, if you can guess how many links without actually counting them. We will mention your name in the next video. Your, your, your username. And or, or if you actually, you know, guess right and you actually post your real name, we'll put your real name. Or I will give you, I will say something sexual just for you. You get to pick it though. You get to pick it. And, and she, she. I have no dignity. She has no dignity. No she, shame. she will say whatever you want her to say. <laughs> You're making me she, sound she, like she a whore. She's your word whore. So. Okay. Uh, You're on my bed. I, I cleaned this bed. I, I, I've cleaned that bed in other ways. And by other ways, I mean sleeping, but he thinks it's dirty. I'm a dude, what do you expect? For you to have a girlfriend. At the moment. Can you hear me now? Good! Drink show me soda. Knock on wood. Uh, I don't drink soda. Uh-huh. Kids, soda is bad for you. But it's good for your soul. You don't have a soul. That hurts. That hurt. I commented how he doesn't have a girlfriend, and that hurt. <laughs> <laughs> that shows where his priorities are. <laughs> I said priorities right. Yay! She hasn't been able to speak all day. I haven't. I'm still wondering why you have a kite hanging in your room. Because it's a really difficult kite to fly. So I bought it, and I can't fly it, so I might as well hang it in my room. And that was Munchie's commentary. I wonder if you guys can actually hear him. Wait, hold up. Did I save it when it stopped? I think I just lost a few minutes of... I did. Aww. Aww. Not gonna hear about how he... I don't even know what we said. What are we talking about? I don't know. We left and went to Lowe's. Yeah. Papa wanted to go, and I put on something dark so I don't look so bright. Oh, because I'm not bright at all. No, no, she's not bright. As in bright, as in happy. Dick. You brought it upon yourself. You said it. He's a dick and I'm a tit. She drove all the way to the Dollar General. I feared for my life. I am not a bad driver. No, you're a better driver than Jamie. What stupid things can I think of to do? What? Nothing. Uh -huh. This is gonna be an awkward part. It makes me feel like Chinese royalty. This is gonna be edited so much. Okay. Silences. That's my wand. I hope you realize that. Avada Kedavra. Why are you wearing my smokeless jacket? She always fixes my collar, no matter what. <laughs> you know, I, I've seen her in the middle of school. In the middle of school, you know, we'll be walking down the hall, and there'll be someone she doesn't even know, and their tag will be sticking out of their uh, shirt or something, and she'll go and she'll fix it. That's funny. Uh, especially when they turn around and like, what the hell? I probably shouldn't have said that. Ah, uh, you can do a funny noise over it. I don't have any funny noises saved on my computer. Find one, yeah. I could use that Phonezilla thing or whatever it is you should Phone Phonezoo. Phonezoo. Another link I'll send to you through my bar that's down here under my bed. 
Oh my god, Umbridge, stop texting me. Now you need to do another link to uh, Star Kid. Okay, well, Cleavage. Wait, is that how you say it? Cleavage. Not cleavage. cleavage. I say Cleavage, but it's Cleavage. 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 I never say that though. Oh, I told you about camera. Giant tits. What, what's your favorite nickname that I gave her? Titzilla. Titzilla. Yes. Titzilla. That's camera. I love you, Cammy. She's one of my subscribers. Oh. You should be. Why aren't you subscribed to me? I'm too lazy. <laughs> my best friend of seven years, and he doesn't support my video. You know what I'm there? I've got hair from the guinea pig all over me. Sure, it's the guinea pig hair. Yes, it is, because <laughs> I don't have white hair. Shame, I, shame. Well, actually, I wake up every day at noon and I uh, go on my fa Facebook on my iPod. I'm too lazy to go downstairs on the computer. Uh, I stay in my room for another three hours, and then I eat something, and then I just watch TV. He eats a lot. Hence the name Munchie. That's not how I got the name. It's not because of how much I ate. It's because of the way I ate a piece of chocolate. Why does everyone get that mixed up? Most people think it's because he's a pothead, but he hates pot. Yeah, I don't smoke. I'm formulating. You know what's weird? My parents would never let me have a guy in my room with my door shut. But when it's Munchie, all they say is, well, it's Munchie. Now you're going to get to hear my dog bark for like an hour. For those of you, because my, this hand is normally off screen, I just flipped her off. I tend to do that a lot. This is a, one of our teacher's animals, and Sam is watching it for the summer. I wanted to get the snake that she had in the classroom, but someone else had already volunteered. It, it's sad that one of my other friends, stepmom and dad, didn't know I had another name. They thought my name was Munchie. His real name's Brian Diaz. His last name's Diaz. I got giggled out of that when I first heard it. See, the thing is, is on that last day of school that, you know, I saw the animals, I had uh, helped move the, her cage into her car, and I had the hamster sniffing on me, her gerbil. Guinea pig. Guinea pig. I, <laughs> yeah, whatever. It took um, three tries. <laughs> three tries. Yeah, and uh, then I went to go hold the snake. And the snake had no problem with me. And then my my other friend's girlfriend came up and started petting it. And it reared its head back like it was going to strike and I had to put it away. It's all her fault. We blame a lot of things on her. We don't like her. No. Wow. Ginger loves me. This doesn't look right. They could like freeze frame and edit. Photoshop. <laughs> but see, nothing ever would happen between us. There's like no romantic charge or anything. Yeah, all my secrets, I think. Yeah. I don't know if she's ever mentioned her middle name. She hates it. No, because somebody commented on one of my videos what my whole name is and what I'm on Facebook. Mm -hmm. it w I've mentioned this in the video before. It was funny. Or I could just edit that part. I know how to edit parts out. I know how to cut them and all that. Yeah, ow. Cut them out. <laughs> ow. <laughs> I do that. Rawr. There are no such thing as dinosaurs. They're just a construct of the government to hide the existence of Pokemon. Pokemon, gotta catch them all. Wait, could they sue me for that? No. Okay. Smosh proof of it. They, they have go. they have a guinea pig too. Its name is Charlie the Drunken Guinea Pig. I wonder if Charlie and Ginger would ever date. <laughs> I hit him a lot too. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I have so much nerve damage that I don't feel pain. <laughs> I hit you, but I don't hit on you. <laughs> oh, and if anyone, anyone feels generous, on Smosh.com there's a t-shirt that says, What the Fire Truck. Get it for me. I'm a size medium. <laughs> the address to send it to is 101 South New Street, Whitakers, North Carolina. The zip code is 27891. Do not send severed body parts, because he'll give them to me. Or do not try to come to my house to kill me. Because as, as it has been stated in this video earlier, I have over a thousand knives and twenty swords. It might have been in the part that we lost. Well, now it's been stated, just in case. Just in case. <laughs> Don't eat my hair, I only have so much of it. He shaved his head by accident. I used the wrong peppers. I was bald. <laughs> I was going to do a Lex Luthor joke, but he was in Asheville. Yeah. And it always funnier in person. Yeah, and you know, by that time my hair grew back and now he's all fuzzy. This, this is a hobbit's foot. And this 
is a Wookiee's leg. He's a mutant. Hobbit feet. Wookie legs. Oh, sometimes the law is stupid. He's a very responsible they person. Probably would be. Yeah. One of the few times I'll compliment him. Yeah, I don't get that that very often. Mm -mm. It's uh. But it's been seven years. I'm a lot of insult. In my family, that's how we love each other. We insult each other. In my family, we make fun of each other and try to make each other cry. He met my grandpa. Isn't he funny? Yes. He's hilarious. We share the same name, Brian. But they spell it differently. He spells it with an I, he spells it with an I. They have two different meanings. The one with an I means high and kingly. My name means um, heard by God, which is funny because I'm not Christian. But I do believe in God. In my native tongue, Samantha means pain. She's just trying to say how awesome I am, but we can't understand her. Then she how do you know that she's trying to say you're awesome? <laughs> how do you know she's not like... Hell, let me out of here. We have these crazy people. <laughs> because I can speak animals. You can't and they can't understand her, but I can. Have okay. you ever wondered that if the doctor can, can hear every language because of the TARDIS, can he understand animals? He can understand human hybrid animals. But I mean, I mean can't, what, would he be able to understand? Wait, isn't there an episode where he's talking to an animal? No, not that I remember. No. He's obsessed with the doctor too. I love the doctor, but Tennant, and he likes Baker. Tennant's my favorite. I thought Tom Baker was your favorite. No, Tom Baker was my first. We, we have different ways of expressing it. She, you know. Orgasms every time I hear his name. Mm -hmm, Tennant. <laughs> um, I just enjoy his acting. Well, he's an amazing actor. I'll admit that. But I'm a girl, so he's look, also handsome. Look, look, look him up. You know, I'll from Hamlet. Hamlet. That, he did a really great performance. Uh, I'll show you a picture of Kenneth. You'll see why I like him. And, and ladies and gay men, he has a Scottish accent. Who is your favorite character in Harry Potter? Favorite character or favorite character? Both. Uh, favorite character would probably have to be Harry because he's more relatable to me. And yeah, I like Jenny. My favorite character and my favorite character are the same people, and that is Fred and, and George, George Weasley. I have to say, if I ever go lesbian and I get married and I want my girlfriend to have a child, I would use munchie sperm. Well, you have brown hair like I do. We get confused as brother and sister all the time. Yeah, uh, so it's more or less because I'm... But it's also because of your personality, your ge genetics, you're a good person altogether. I don't know many guys like that. Yes. But you're a pervert, so that's a negative, but I'm a pervert too. So it wouldn't matter no matter what, so... Unless I get like a... But, 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 okay, if, it, if it's if it's a lesbian relationship, who would carry the baby? That's a, I don't know, because I don't know who I would date if I was a lesbian. It, I would probably date, like, a girl who's younger than me and is real innocent, like... Pedophile. I am not a pedophile! Well, seeing how my crush is younger than me, yeah. yeah. He's 15, I think. Wow, pedophile. Wow. Cradle robber. I would not have a child that's 15 years old. Because I'm 18. Logically impossible. No, it's not. But I can't have a child at three. If you do a time-traveling joke, I will kill you. No. I was going to say another pedophile. And that's where you got it. <laughs> but I can't, I physically cannot have a child at three years old. There have been elementary kids who have had three. Yeah, at ten. <laughs> from the future again. From the future, meeting you again, you know. We, we, we just saved the world. You'll see. You will see. But, um, seniorpeoplemeet.com. My, I don't know, I don't remember if I've said this, uh, my name is Senior Lover 41 If you want to talk to me up there. He um, will add you on that. I will add you on that. Just say that you remember me from Sam's, uh, video. Give him the password. Cucumber. Lotion Cucumber. That's the password. And, uh, not cucumber, lotion, lotion cucumber. Lotion cucumber. And uh, t tell me an approximate age. You just say middle school, high school, or college. And just if you're me. older than that, you're kind of creepy. Yeah. 
sucks a little bit. <laughs> and I mean, it's not as creepy as, you know... A, My ex-boyfriend? Or a 17-year-old, you know, adding, you know, people on SeniorMeet.com. <laughs> that's just, that, that's just weird. That's just... It's, that's another link that we'll have under there. We're going back to the future now, so... So, so Camera and Arelli are three of my friends that I would stay in contact with after high school, and that's my plan. Uh, I, I want to find a really nice flat, you know, studio flat. Mm -hmm. Not an apartment, a flat. Shut up, I've been watching British TV for too long. I do it too, don't worry. And it's not soccer, it's football. And it's not kissing, it's snogging. And he's my mate, not my friend. I do say snog. I love snog. I love to say that word instead of kissing. I would say snog. Would you like a snog? Fancy a snog, mate. Sn snog just sounds like, you know, some sort of drink. <laughs> no, when I think of snogging, for some reason I think of snog. Because it sounds so similar. I got guinea pig fur all over me. Don't you want one? Mama, mama, mama.